Hello everyone, welcome to the United Coder video tutorial. In this video tutorial, I will explain how you can do voice activated test automation. When we design test automation framework, most of the time we use different actions, such as opening the browser, doing Google search, verify some search result. And when you do test automation for company internal applications, you log in the applications and you simulate the business. And once the test is done, you terminate the browser. So in this example, I will use the Amazon voice transcription with Selenium WebDriver. So this is a uh, simple demo code. In this demo code, we get the voice from microphone. And when I speak to the microphone, the computer will use the Amazon transcribe API to translate my voice into text. And based on the text, it will perform browser actions, such as if I say open browser, the system will open the browser. And if I say, say search Java, the system will uh, search Java on Google. And if I say shut down, then the br browser will be closed. If I say complete, the program will end and the code will be terminated. Now let's run the test. So this is Transcribe Streaming Demo App. You can find the app on Amazon AWS Transcribe API or just Google it and you can find the sample. I use the sample on Amazon website and I added some Selenium WebDriver actions. So now I run the application. Now I can start talking and the text will be displayed. Now as you see, when I say something, it will display on the console. Now I give some command. Hi. Hello. Open browser. Open browser. Search Java. As you see, the Java is searched. Now it just keeps searching because when I speak to the screen, it just keep transcribing my word and it keeps searching. Now, if I say shut down, shut down. Let's look at the application and find out what the application transcribed on the console. It just printed out like arbitrary text. I have never spoken, but I can speak slowly. Shut down. Shut down. Complete. As you see, the program is terminated. So the code is supposed to shut down all the browsers. It opened uh, previously, but it did not close it. Because on the console, as you see, after shutdown, there is a uh, dot. So probably I need to add the dot and then find out. Or if I simply change this, if the text contains shut, then it will uh, close the browser. So let me change the code. Now let's run the test again. So I will close all the browser.
I run the code now. Hi. Hello. Open browser. Open browser. Search Java. Search Java. Shut down. Shut down. Shut down. Now let's look at the console and find out what's going on. So it did not transcribe my word. So let me say shut down. Complete. As you see, it did not close the browser uh, for the shutdown uh, because we need to change the code. In the browser actions, actually there is a code. If the text contain is shut, then it should perform the shutdown. So now let me run the code again and it will uh, close the browser. So let's start the test again. Hello. Welcome to United Coder. This is voice activated test automation. Open browser. Open browser. Search Java. Search Java. Search Java. Now it keeps searching the word Java. Shut down. Shut down. Complete. 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 Hello? I guess the code is uh, doing some other uh, activation, but it should uh, complete the code. So previously, like uh, when I say complete, it terminated. So I can uh, stop the streaming app. Now I can run the code again. Hi. Open browser. Search Java. Search Java. Search Java. Shut down. Shut down. Complete. Complete. Complete the program. Hello? Complete the program. Yeah, after browser shut down, uh, it did not perform other actions, uh, but basically this is how you can use uh, voice activated uh, test automation with Selenium WebDriver. Thanks for watching.